Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Travis. Today we're going to be testing this phytoplankton that's actually been in the freezer for about five months. If you guys remember back in May 19th is actually when I uploaded the original video where we tested this stuff after being in the refrigerator for already a month and then uh, freezing it and then seeing if it will last uh, indefinitely. But uh, anyways, I know that I said in that video that I was only gonna wait a month or two and then test it. Well, I forgot, one of the subscribers reminded me, so I appreciate that. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and test it. Now, uh, one thing that I did notice is af after it unthawed, the uh, phyto definitely settled to the bottom, indicating that there was definitely going to be some die off in this, but it smells fine. I mean, it smells like phytoplankton. I mean, I wouldn't add it to a protein shake, but I mean, it's fine. I mean, the consistency looks good. There's really no issues. Only thing is, is that it does settle over a 24 hour period. So uh, what we're going to do is uh, I got the camera up here, so we're going to be able to look inside the uh, uh, microscope, but I'm going to move the camera around and then we'll, uh, we're going to test this stuff out. Okay. So let's go ahead and get the uh, sample here on the slide. Now there will be an overlay uh, that you guys will see exactly what's going on here in the microscope. Only need a drop, a little bit more than a drop. All right. Let's go ahead and see what we got here, make some adjustments. Get this out of the way before I uh, spill it. All right, so let's go and see if we can find. All right, let's go ahead and uh, crank her up. Some adjustments here. Do we see anything alive? Ooh, it doesn't look alive to me. And zoom in here. Remember, we were testing to see if this was possible because a lot of people say you could freeze the phytoplankton that it will survive. Well, guys, I don't see, let me move it around here, but I don't see anything that's alive. And now it's been out of the freezer for about four days now, so it's not like I just unthawed it yesterday. Um, I don't see any. Uh, any life. Now what I am going to do is we'll make a part three of this series and I'll actually uh, try to bring it back to life. So I'll throw it up on the, uh, the Fido uh, station there and try to bring it back. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit more. Uh, too close. Um, so I'm going to try to bring this sample back to life. That way we can see if maybe they're just kind of in a hibernation phase because of the cold and they've been in the freezer. So we'll see if that's part of it. But uh, right now nothing seems Nothing seems alive. It, it's all, nothing's moving. If you guys remember the last sample, which matter of fact, let me go ahead and uh, I'll show you a difference. I'll just grab a sample right out of the uh, uh, the Fido station, throw it on the slide, and you guys will see the difference. And uh, yeah, let me go and do that real quick. All right, so I just grabbed a little bit off the uh, Fido station there. Um, as I mentioned before, I am going to bring this back, or at least attempt to. So let's go ahead and see the uh, difference between a either a hibernating or a dead colony and what the stuff looks like. There we go, it's already cruising. Let me back up so you get, give you a little bit of a better idea. So you see the difference? So they're alive and well. I'm gonna make a couple more adjustments here. Crank her up. So as you can see, there's a, there's a major difference between our, uh, again, either hibernating or dead. It smells it smells alive. There's no staleness or anything like that. So I am definitely going to make a part three of this, uh, hopefully <laughs> within the next couple of weeks. It only takes a couple of weeks to bring this stuff back if it's, uh, you know, if we're trying to reculture stuff. So, uh, yeah, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, look out for part three and I will, in part three, I will put all uh, of the other two videos in the uh, comment section so you guys can follow along. But either way, that's about it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and we didn't necessarily necessarily learn anything other than the fact if it's in the freezer for five months it's probably it's going to smell fine but uh it's not it doesn't appear to be alive uh, and again we'll find out here in a couple weeks if it's actually uh still alive so that's about it hopefully you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you later peace